So we set up a clinical study many years ago and uh, at the time the role of lenalidomide in causing second primary cancers was a very controversial fact and so we really set out to do this as well as you possibly could and so one of the studies had been uh, closed because of a potential excess risk of cancers and the important message after following up for something like 10 years now is there's not really an excess risk of second cancers there's perhaps a little extra risk there is some excess of skin cancers but the risk that we worried about initially is no longer a problem and so in terms of the risks and benefit of being on long-term treatment with drugs like uh, thalidomide, lenalidomide or pomalidomide I think it's very minimal compared to their uh, beneficial effects on the disease.